Sagittarius, this will be your reading for all my Sagittarius placements. Yes, we're in Sagittarius season. I know one day passed already, but the breeze passed. Now we're in it. We're in the season. So, all my Sagittarius is happy birthday. You understand? I, I, I connect with you, okay? I do have um, Sagittarius placement in my birth chart, so I understand y'all. Don't think I don't, okay? So, happy birthday. Let's go into your reading for your birthday, all right? <clears throat> Sagittarius. Ooh, okay, Sagittarius, two cards coming out first. We have the page of wands here, and then we have the sun card here. So first of all, I don't know if you're welcoming a baby boy. Congratulations if you are. I, there's something very significant about the sun, or a sun. Or someone's son, okay? No, if that's not what you're connecting to, Sagittarius, then I see you having a pretty damn good time traveling. I'm not sure how you're traveling now if it's COVID time, but you are probably find your ways. You're a Sagittarius. I feel like you're traveling somewhere. I don't know if you're going camping, Sagittarius, or you're just kind of moving away from people. It's like you're finding peace. It's like the more... Oh, Sagittarius. Um, people who have Sagittarius placements um, at a part in their life, whether that's young or old, you're going to have to choose between whether you want to live among people and in the city or whether you want to um, live very secluded in the suburbs. And that's going to play a, a very big role when it comes down to like your spiritual development. Um, so yeah, I don't know if you're leaving everything and you're traveling somewhere. I feel like you, you just want to travel somewhere where have sun. You need sun. I feel like you need sun. Or there's something very significant about your dad. The holy stone here coming out here. So something significant and something religious. What is happening here? For others of you, you may be um, baptizing or christen, cr christening or whatever your, your, your kid. So that may be a really, really happy time for you. You know, the baby's born. They're going to get the blessings, all of that stuff. For others of you, Sagittarius, I feel like you know it. Okay, I don't have to go back to this. Because the sun, the sun in the cards are bothering me. It's like you know you have a child somewhere. Now, you may be visiting this child. But I feel like, uh, I don't know, there's something very weird when it comes on to your energy, Sagittarius, and the energy of this, this card. Who do you want a child, this card? Yeah, we have an earth sign here in the reverse. So Sagittarius, I don't know if you... I feel like there's someone here you might have um, went into a relationship with or if you had a child with this person um, I feel like the person is very very unhappy with the things that you're teaching this child I feel like if you have a child you're taking the child out and you're showing them everything that you as a man would want to show you know your son but I feel like the, the the earth sign have a problem with it. There's something about the way you do things, Sagittarius, or your teachings. Maybe you're very cold and very... Oh, you're a Sagittarius, though. Um, maybe you're very direct and the words that come out of your mouth may not be suitable for kids around you. But I feel like whatever you're doing here, it seems lovely. I'm mean, not nothing wrong with it. There are the four of cups in the reverse. You're no longer holding back. Exactly. You're kind of letting out. So we have the Queen of Swords and we have the Emperor here. Lovely card. So I don't know if this is your parents. Okay, so your parents could have actually had the child as your Sagittarius. Because you're kind of trying to figure out... I don't know if you're trying to get your, your head clear about this child or you're trying to get your, hair, your head clear about maybe going through something else personal like a... 
something religious, something spiritual. Maybe you're going through, you're just going through something that really is going to, it's having a hard time on your mental stability when it comes on to a female or male um, earth sign. And I feel like to take some of the pressure off you, your parents probably have the kids. Seven of Pentacles in the reverse. Now they could have taken the kid from your Sagittarius because um two things. One, maybe you stopped working and you decided to go elsewhere for a job. Or two. I kind of feel like you. I mean, I don't want to say you, but maybe you are the person. Here's the energy I'm going to get, right? It's not that the person's irresponsible. But I feel like the person's focus is more on them. And not on the child. But I don't know if it's for reasons. Because, again, you or somebody else's head is kind of caught up in a lot of things right now. Or if it's because of your ego. Because I get Leo off of the snow. Yeah, look, we have the page of, what name? name? Right at time. Yeah, so I'm going to, exactly, I'm going to know if it's your ego. Because this card really do symbolizes the womanizer. The person who is attractive. The person, he's, he doesn't ask for attention. But him is of the same kind. Look on them shirts. They have the same cross, you know. Right here, wait a Right here, so right here. So yeah, they have the same cross though. There's some very so I don't know if your parents is holding on on your kids so you can go back and work things out with a fire sign. Or I feel like maybe the earth sign had a kid with another fire sign. And I don't know if you're trying to come in to take back something. I feel like you're trying to come in and take something or take back something or stand up for something because the only cards here that's in the reverse is the four of cups and the seven of pentacles so everything seems like it's going okay oh and the queen of pentacles all right let's go around one more time six of swords here walking away you walked away from her or that situation or it could be that you're just walking away from a life of All eyes have to always be on me type of vibe where you always kind of I don't know I feel you brag you like to brag a lot you like to brag a lot okay yes you are such I keep forget why am I keep forgetting y'all you know like for brag a lot and it's okay sometimes you have to brag sometimes you have to make people know who the F you is but I feel a weird bragging vibe from this maybe a bragging vibe about leaving somebody Or what you didn't give to somebody. I feel like it's what you never give to somebody. You know? We have the queen back in the reverse here. And we have the queen. Um, the page of swords here in the reverse. Now it could be as it relates to a air sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. For others of you. The baby might be with the parents of the female. But I feel like this person's kind of waiting on some money from you. Some type of payment. Some type of something. Because I feel like, you know what I feel? I feel like there was a child that was born. It's not that you denied a child, but in the back of your head, you knew that a child was yours. Or maybe you knew a child wasn't yours. But somebody wants money from you or somebody's trying to get money out of the situation. I'm not going to help though. Or maybe the person thought that if they got pregnant for your Sagittarius, then you automatically going to want to care for them and the child. You might have gotten realization about that and you're like, hell no. Yeah, hell to the effing no. We have the Friday of Pentacles in the reverse. I don't feel like you want to be a part of this anymore. Furthermore, I don't know if this person has somebody else on the side. Again, we spoke about that already. There's someone here who's protecting a... Yeah, I was going to say a holy place. These are the guides here. It's, but it's not a holy place. It's like they're protecting us. Not a secret. It's a... 
I feel like, okay, this could be a building. If it's not a building, then there's someone who's protecting something. I don't know what to call it. It's I don't know what to call it. The two of cups in the reverse. So for others of you, somebody kind of probably could just be using religion or spirituality to come in and try to date you. I don't feel like them genuine. It might be an earth sign. But I also, but for others of you, I also feel like there's an earth sign coming in and the person went through a really bad breakup, right? Or they were dating someone and the, 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 the exchange escalated into something that caused them to lose their job. And I feel like right now I'm searching for a lot of answers. Maybe along with the kid. The world card here. Yeah, yeah, search for some answers, man. But there is a completed cycle. It's just, I feel like you had to get the truth about something. And, and again, I don't know if this earth sign wasn't giving, giving you the truth. Or maybe this was your mom protecting something. There's something here. Very spiritual, very holy. That was... It was pushed apart for some reason. It could be because of work. It could be because of somebody else. But I feel like... I feel like all you need, Sagittarius, is just to confirm this kid and then you're done. You know exactly what to do or who to leave. Ten of Pentacles, ten of... Sorry, ten of Wands here, upright. Yeah, I feel like you just need, needed to confirm one thing and then every burden that you have, you're going to drop. Because there is two females here. Um, for others of you, oh, the Sagittarius season is crazy. I swear I wasn't going to do any readings. For others of you, right? I feel like this. This is how I feel. I feel like everything is all over the place. For others of you, right? You might be following a spiritual practitioner or a spiritual person, but kind of come to find out that maybe this person, them doing something that is not... Uh, okay, for example, if they're saying that them is a... Uh, there's something unethical or unholy, referring to the Holy Stone, about maybe what this person is teaching, what this person is saying. There is a connection between an earth sign and a fire sign here. I don't know if this is someone totally different um, from you, Sagittarius. But we feel like these people are having problems mostly because the earth sign is very unhappy. Because the fire sign keep... I feel like him keep a fine excuse for leave the house. And when him leave the house, him going to show other people in poll. That's what I feel. That's how I feel. Ace of cups in the reverse. And you hate it. You don't like it. Because this person not giving you the cup. Them giving it to somebody else. And you're, you or somebody else, Sagittarius, is already here in the reverse. I'm already feeling burned. There's something very significant about a dad. I said that already. I'm going to say it again. If it's not a dad, it's a son. There's a, there's a significance of the son. I feel like he's just a significant of the truth that you've been looking for, Sagittarius, for a very long time. And I feel like um, there are maybe two people who already knew the truth all along, but they just wouldn't like they want to give it to you. Now we have a water sign here at the bottom of the deck here. So I don't know if this person is coming in or you're connecting to this person. Um, but I feel like overall, I feel like you kind of find out. Yeah, you, you find out what you need to find out. So I mean, yeah. Um, but my fire sign here with the 10 of swords. You probably find out what you need to find out. So again, again, you're kind of done with this fire sign or if it's a fire earth sign, you're done with this connection. You just needed to find out. I guess if the kid was yours, the illusions are off now. Seven of cups. So yeah, Sagittarius. I understand you for... That's a lot. Sagittarius, let's go. I respect the prosperity of others. 
I benefit with the gratitude and I am peaceful. So until next time, Sagittarius, meta.